Hi guys, welcome to my channel first of all and thank you very much for watching. This is the second in a series of vlogs that I'm doing, uh, Stroke 1 to 3 and basically it's just me playing Stroke Index 1, 2 and 3 and today I'm on my home course, North Manchester Golf Club. I believe it's probably one of the toughest courses in Greater Manchester, uh, I think in North West to be fair, I think it's a really tough course. Um, it's so many different, every hole's different completely. Uh, there's no real straight holes in a way. I think hole 15 is probably the, the easiest one where you can you can probably drive the green. Um, but yeah, stroke index one to three. Uh, I'm going to try and par it, of course. I never do. I haven't done yet. It's only the second second in a in a series. This, but the first one was at Knott's Hollingwell, and I, uh, I actually plus one it. So, want the best to be fair. The weather is shocking, but we're in Manchester, so no, nothing different there. Um, I also wanted to quickly tell you about my charity brand. Uh, 1218. So basically I've set up this with two partners and 1218 is a charity golf brand where basically any transaction that goes, any, any transaction 20% or more goes to a chosen charity and this year it is Prostate Cancer UK. So 1218.com, get over there, check it out, here's a link here. Go and check it out, go and check the website out. If you purchase anything, yeah, you'll get sent a link directly straight away which tells you that you've donated to Prostate Cancer via the just giving page so there's no you know there's no hidden fees or no hidden transaction or anything it's all uh, above board <laughs> and what is it, do you say above board but anyway um it's all official basically um so yeah the, it's a charity golf brand there's apparel there's hats on there and basically you just play the course with pride that's that's what i'm saying is you play the course with pride so when you're on the course and you see this logo you know that person has donated to the chosen charity at the time so yeah get yourself there and in fact, check this out, here's a little 10% for you. Go and check it out, a little 10% off. Go to the checkout, purchase whatever you want, put that offer code in and you get 10% off. Anyway, let's get back to me playing Stroke Index 1, 2 and 3 and let's see if I can par it, if not better it. Oh, I might even bogey it or double bogey it, you never know. Anyway, anyway, let's get there, let's see how we go. Um, this is this is probably one of the most hardest out of the three to be fair, so basically it's kind of a, uh, it's a little doggy to the right in a way, um, but then it kind of feeds back to the left into the green, so it's a bit of a, a bit of a strange one. But basically, I normally take a five wood or even a driver, it it up the left hand side of the fairway, and it kind of fends down into the right of the fairway because of the slope. And then hopefully, then you get a good look into the green. So I'm going to use my five wood on this one because the weather's not the best here. So I'm going to try and skim it low, uh, keep it low, and uh, see how we go. So let's uh, let's crack on. So for the first time in a long time, I've actually done what I said I was going to do. So I skimmed it low, kept it low, faded it, uh, faded it over the left hand side of the fairway and hopefully it's fended down right to give me a good look into the green. So I've landed, um, I've landed about 200 and, I'm still about 200 off um, to the right of the fairway, but I'm getting old Del Boy out, old Del Boy's coming out, which is my four hybrid, the little Ping G four hybrid. Hopefully I should be able to should be able to reach the green there. If not, I'll uh, I'll just fall short of it. Yeah, I fell short a bit, but I'm uh, quite happy with that strike. Let's get down there and see. So as I'm walking up to the next shot, which is landed, or well, looking at it, it's landed around about 20 yards, 20 yards off the flag at the front of the green, but, so I've gone five wood, and I've gone four hybrid, and I'm still not there, and that's why it probably is stroke index one. It is a tough hole, obviously you've got the slope as well, left to right, on the fairway, but, uh, yeah, tough, tough hole this one, tough hole, certainly a, and a second hole to start off your round, it's a, it could uh, it could destroy someone's round in a comp. 
But yeah, I've landed. Oh, sorry. There, I'm up there to the right, just just uh, just before the green. So I don't know if you can see the flag there. I hope you can. Um, but yeah, I've landed around about I don't know, I don't know, 50 foot away. No, it's not. It's mad going in feet, but yeah, about uh, about tw about 20, 30 yards off anyway. Um, I'm going to use a little 58 degree, try and chip it up and stop it on the way back down. Long, a little bit long, and that's what you don't really want to be on this uh, on this hole. You really want to be putting up up the, the bit of a slight hill. Anyway, let's get to the hole. Let's get to the ball. And it's stroke index free. Now they changed this um, in January, I think they changed it. And what I normally take here is a uh, an eight or a seven iron because it's around about 145 to a, a bit of a ridge river, and then uh, obviously it's over. So uh, let's see how we get on. So yeah, a little bit leaky there, a little bit right, uh, a little bit left to right, but uh, probably fell about 20, about about 30 yards short of the uh, short of the ridge. So yeah, normally take a small seven iron, uh, get it short of the ridge, but uh, let's go up there and see how we got. green let's get out there so as you can see the rain has kicked in but I'm still gonna continue nothing stops me so yeah on that hole I normally go seven 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 sometimes seven six depending where I've obviously landed on the fairway but um, I've gone seven seven there and I've leaked out to the left of the green so hopefully a good up and down now and uh, jobs are good and let's see Right guys, just right of the green, uh, sorry, just left of the green, um, left and right, just left of the green, uh, it's actually a front, front flag as well, so I'm only around about 30 yards away, nice little sandwich, hopefully get it close, try and get a par, uh, try and, yeah, just try and get a par, let's see what we can do. It is wet by the way, hopefully it's a little, little scoop up, a little scoop down. Oops, fell a bit short there. I wanted it, I wanted it past if anything. So guys, a little left to right, I'd say around about 10 foot. Would you say 10 foot? Yeah. See if you can salvage it past. Yeah. 
Danny, Danny. Can you believe that? Did a free throw, did a, did a, did a nighter. Oh, Danny. Anyway. To be fair, he was left to right downhill. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get to the next one. The next one, stroke index two. And let's see if we can get a power on the last one. Uh, so I've gone bogey bogey. Not the best to be fair. Weather's pretty rubbish. No excuses. But that's why the stroke index one and three. Simple as that. Let's get to the last one. Right guys, we're on the last hole of this uh, series of me versus stroke one, two, three. This is stroke index number two. And it's a bit of a dog left. Uh, it's quite a difficult course to be honest. It's a driver for me. It's a driver hole all day long. Um, there's a there's an out of bounds as well. There's an out of bounds as well, which is um, it's, it's hang on, let's see. It's there. So basically, all here is a, a little lake, a little fishing lake actually. So basically, a driver, hopefully a fade off this off these trees to the left, fade driver, um, and just get it up there really. Let's see how we do. Here we go, driver roll all day long. I'm going to try and fade it off the left trees. Try. Uh, fade it off the left trees. I'm currently at plus two at the minute, so I'm not doing the best to be fair. So I need to uh, need to get this in two to even par it, which uh, is not going to happen. So uh, anyway, it's not about that. It's just about showing you. Um, yeah, try and fade it off the left trees. Um, try and get around about 250 out of it, 250, 260. Let's see how I do. Faded, faded off the trees like I said, but I faded a little bit too much. Right guys, I am around about 200 yards into the hole, which, which means only one thing and one thing only. Good old Del Boy's coming out. This little lad here. This time next year, we'll be millionaires. Probably not, but anyway. Which is my four hybrid, Pink G. Ball is full of grass, no excuses. Hopefully, get a good look in. There's a flag up there which gives you an indication where the pin is. The leather green is so empty. Hopefully, I can get it front edge or even on the other. On the, we'll see. We'll see. A little bit left of the hole, a little bit left of the green. I don't know where the hole is. <laughs> A little bit left of the greens. Look at this, ain't he? Oh, little little Del Boy. He's even got his chain on, look. See his chain? You can't see his chain, can you? There you can. Anyway, let's get up there and see how, uh, how left of the green it was. Right, guys. A little bit left of the green. Look, it looks straight there, but I am left of the green. Um, I'm going to put a little sandwich. Hopefully, a little sandwich close because I need a par here. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. About three or four foot weight there. Here we go, guys. Little uh, little four footer, right to left. See what I can do. Yeah. 
Thanks very much for watching guys, I'm uh, just going under the trees which is great because my camera's got absolutely soaking wet today weather's not been the best but yeah, like I said guys, if, um, if you like the video please subscribe, it'd be much appreciated and don't forget as well guys to um, check out the brand, check out the charity brand well, I'm not going to call it a charity brand because I don't want to I don't want to um, generate turnover through charity or what, what I do is actually donate to charity so um, yeah, like I said, the charity brand and uh, yeah, get yourself to 1218.com. And uh, again, thank you very much for watching this. Sorry I couldn't power it for you. Uh, but at least it gives you a good insight into North Manchester Golf Club. Uh, thank you very much to Jason Peel as well from allowing me to film. I know it's my own golf course, but it's always nice to ask. And uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one, guys. Take care. See you later.